Hey guys, welcome back to the Wadoc Project 365, episode 1714. Guys, if you follow along on YouTube, jump on over to thewaddoc.com. Check out all the full length videos that we house there. Today, what we're doing is releasing the distal um, area of our bicep, kind of where that mild tendinous junction is. That's where it gets really sore after all those pulling movements. Maybe something that got sore for you after uh, 19.4. But in any case, we're going to spend some time releasing right there. You can do this in a number of different ways. You can use an instrument, you can use a stick. It's tough to get in here with the foam roller. You get your arm up over top of a, uh, of a bar and do it that way. Today we're gonna use the la lacrosse ball to do that, okay? We're, we're gonna use the lacrosse ball to, to break apart and, and release that mild tendinous area of the bicep, okay? So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna hold that lacrosse ball in a direction going, <coughs> excuse me, going towards my elbow. I'm gonna apply uh, pressure downwards into the pit of my elbow as I give myself a little shelf here with my with my uh, my legs my thighs and then I'm just gonna go ahead and allow my body to fold over notice my palm is up okay there's two things that I can change here as I hold that pressure and as I come down I can do two things after I hold that how long will we hold it for we hold it for anywhere between 10 and 15 seconds Try to keep the bicep as relaxed as you can. Going back to the two things that you can do. You can move laterally or towards the thumb or towards the, the ulnarly, uh, towards the pinky, right? Uh, in both cases, you're just not gonna be in the center, right? Or you can keep uh, the lacrosse ball into the center, apply that pressure, and now turn the wrist back and forth, okay? It's a good technique to be able to do if you are not contracting your bicep. What we're not trying to do is we're not trying to contract our bicep into that region. All we're trying to do is fold it over top, get some pressure, get some of that ischemic pressure, take advantage of the properties of what ischemic pressure does, okay? Questions and comments, please post them below. Otherwise, guys, have a great weekend. And uh, as always, we're here each and every day optimizing function to optimize performance.